Tokyo Disney Resort is located by the Tokyo Bay, not far from Tokyo City Center. Since the opening of Tokyo Disneyland in 1983, it has become one of the most popular tourist destinations in Tokyo. However, if you know Disneyland, you might know it's not the type of the theme park that you can just drop by and ride everything you want to. It's special in many ways. So today, I'd like to show you how to get to Tokyo Disney Resort from Tokyo City Center, especially for visitors going there for the first time. And I'd like to explain a little bit about the parks and what to know with the footage of my day at Tokyo Disney Sea. Tokyo Disney Resort has two theme parks Tokyo Disneyland and Tokyo Disney Sea, with a shopping mall and many Disney hotels and other official hotels. To get to Tokyo Disney Resort, you can take JR Keio Line to Maihama Station. Since the platform of Keio Line at Tokyo Station is far from other lines, you can see 10 to 15 minutes of walking to the platform. So, depends on where you are staying in Tokyo, it might be easier to take Keio Line from other stations such as Hachobori, which is transferred from Hibiya Line, and Shinkiba, which is the last station of Rinkai Line and Yurakucho Line. So this time, I got on Keio Line from Shinkiba Station. From Shinjuku, you can get there either by Chuo Line to Tokyo Station and walk or take Saikyo Line, which goes directly to Shinkiba via Rinkai Line. Once you arrive at my Hama Station, you can walk to Disneyland. If you are going to Disney Sea, you need to take the monorail to Disney Sea. In front of my Hama Station, there's a welcome center and the station for Disney Resort Line. In this welcome center in front of the station, if you are staying at the Disney hotels or official hotels in my Hama area, you can check in your luggage and proceed to the parks. Now let's get to ride this Disney Resort Line. If you ride more than three times a day, you can get this one-day pass. Otherwise, you can just use IC cars such as Suica or Pasmo. There are only four stations on the monorail and it's running counterclockwise. You might wonder which park is better, Disneyland or Disney Sea, And that is a tough question. If you have been to Disneyland in other countries, you might want to go to Disney Sea. Both are based on the many Disney movies, and right now, Disneyland has more factors of princess and fairy tales. But they are opening Fantasy Springs in Tokyo Disney Sea in 2024, with the theme of Tango, Frozen, and Peter Pan, which appeals to more variety of ages. As of today, there are four Disney hotels in Maihama area. One of them, Miracosta, are inside the park and accessible to the park directly. They are planning to open new hotel in 2024 in the Fantasy Springs area inside the Tokyo Disney Sea. My Hama area has the other Disney's official hotels such as Sheraton, Hilton, and Hotel Opera. So if you want to fully enjoy from the morning to night, it might be a good idea to consider the hotel in the My Hama area. So now I'm arriving at Tokyo Disney Sea. There are plenty of lockers in case you have suitcases with you. The price of Disneyland or Disney Sea changes from 7,900 yen to 9,400 yen depending on the date, which is about 60 to 70 US dollars with current exchange rate. I checked the price of the ticket for the Disneyland in Anaheim, and it was 144 for the same day, so it's about a half price in Tokyo. I purchased the ticket online, so either print it out or you can read it into the app of Tokyo Disney Resort. With this app, you can see the waiting time and make reservations for the restaurants and such. The system changes often recently, so I recommend you to check the latest information before your visit. Today I decided to take it easy and enjoy just during the day, but if you want to enjoy it fully, it's better to come early. The past operation time is from 9 am in the morning to 9 at night, but when they announce it's open at 9 a.m., they usually open at 8.20 a.m. It might change day to day, but it's good to know that they open early. When I entered the park, the waiting time for the popular ride was two hours long, and it was impossible for me to ride them before I left. 
So I decided to get on the one with short waiting time, the league of 2000 miles under the sea. Probably I chose Monday, so it was a little busy for the weekdays, but still better than the weekend. So if you are thinking of visiting, it's a must to avoid the weekend. They do have a ticket to skip the line, which costs 1,500 yen to depending on the attractions. But that's sold out quickly unless you line up in the early morning. As you see, it's not a kind of theme park that you can just drop by and get on the attraction you want to try. So if you have some ride that you or your loved one wants to ride, you might want to take it seriously, do research, and arrive before the park opens. There is a way to solve the half of this difficulty by paying more and preparing in advance. That is the vacation package. If the Disney visit is important for you, I recommend you to plan at least a few months in advance and purchase a vacation package, including stay at the Disney hotels. That is including premium access to your choice of major popular rides such as the Beauty and the Beast in the Disneyland. No matter what style you choose, once you are here, let's enjoy the park. This area called Arabian Coast is a theme of Aladdin. This area is somehow less people than other areas, so it's easy to get by. There are many restaurants to eat. Some of them you need to make reservations, but there are many choices of different cafeterias that you can just go in. So we ate curry. They have two different curry. It's good. Okay, nobody's waiting. This year is called Mermaid Lagoon, and the whole area is indoor, so it's good even in the rainy days or super hot summer days. Many attractions are made for kids, so it's good especially for the family with small kids. I tried Raising Spirits, which is mini roller coaster. It was a 60 minute wait, and I think I exactly waited that long. Nemo. I go on the ride called Aquatopia. This part of the park is very close to the real ocean, Tokyo Bay, and have some quiet, chilling atmosphere in the park. I came to an area called Cape Cod. It's a nice Christmas -y town here. Aunt Peg's village store. There are no attractions around here, but it's a nice atmosphere with some shops and restaurants. People start to wait for the show at 7.40 p.m. So it's common to wait for two or three hours for the show at night. <laughs> this is a symbol of Tokyo Disney Sea, SS Columbia. SS means steamship, 
This second park of Tokyo Disney Resort was originally going to be something like Disney Studio Tour, but they changed the plan and used the concept of Disney Park that was going to open in Long Beach, California. Now it's time to go home. I couldn't get on the order ride I wanted, but I enjoyed enough. Tokyo Disney Resort is definitely a good place to visit for both adult groups and families with children. You can get full of the Disney parks, or just enjoy the park's atmosphere like I did. Thank you for watching. Have a great trip to Tokyo and have a great week until the next video.